International Code of Signal, and Flags. The International Code of Signals is an international system of signals and codes for use by vessels to communicate important messages regarding safety of navigation and related matters. The flags are one of the components of ICS. TC signal flags consist of all alphabetic flags and selected numerical flags. Flags A, B, H, G, O, P, and Q are commonly used by mariners while approaching or departing a port and in port to communicate to other vessels in the vicinity and or port personnel. Meanings of commonly used flags. A. I have a diver down. Keep well clear at slow speed. This flag is hoisted when there is a diver carrying out underwater work. B. I am taking in or discharging or carrying dangerous goods. This flag is hoisted on tankers and on cargo. Vessels when carrying dangerous goods or during bunkering operations. G. I require a pilot. This flag is hoisted when the vessel is waiting to get a pilot on board. H. I have a pilot on board. This flag indicates that the vessel has a pilot on board. O. Man overboard. P. In harbor about to sail. All persons report for duty. This flag is hoisted before the vessel is ready to sail. Q. My vessel is healthy and I request free pratik. This flag is hoisted till the vessel is cleared by port health. Flag locker. All flags are kept in a flag locker on the bridge. Courtesy flag. This is the country flag of the port to which the vessel is calling. This flag is flown by the vessel on the foremast, on the starboard outer, halyard prior to, arrival into the port limits. As a mark of respect the country flag, should not be allowed to fall to the ground. House flag. This is the company flag, which is flown on the main mast port, outer halyard. This flag is, also hoisted prior arrival into, port. Ensign flag. This is the flag of the country in which the ship is registered and it is hoisted on the ensign staff right aft. This flag should not be allowed to fall to the ground. Similarly, if any important leader has expired then the flag is flown at half-mast on that day as a mark of respect. When a man of war is passing, the ensign is lowered halfway for saluting and is kept until the other ship has acknowledged the salute and re-hoisted after acknowledgement. Hoisting of flags. All flags are flown from sunrise to sunset. Flag clips. Clips are used for connecting the flags to the halyard. The longer end of rope on the side of flag to connect to halyards should always be towards deck. This ensures the flag is correctly hoisted. Halyards should be held firmly in the hand when hoisting the flag to avoid the line and flag flying away with the wind and getting fouled. All lines should be kept tight to avoid any play when the wind force increases. The lines should be tied to a cleat or to railing by round turn and two half hitches. Fouling of flags. If the flag gets fouled with any obstruction on the mast, inform the duty officer. The flag should be cleared only if weather conditions permit, radar kept on standby, MF or HF transmission seized and working aloft procedures followed.